When Tony Ayers visited England in 1995, he made a discovery that changed his life. He spotted this painting of the Madonna and child tucked away in an antique store and immediately knew it was a Renaissance masterpiece. Ayers wasn't sure who painted it, but the Winnetka native snapped a photo and returned home, determined to prove its authenticity, and his friends got on board. As soon as he showed me the picture, I said, you know what, I'm in. I, I think you have a hunch. I think you're right. Let's see what make happen. Ari Cohen and Philippe Farsi were part of a group of people who pooled their money buying the painting for $30,000. This is a replica. The original is stored in an undisclosed location. Tony then really became obsessed with the painting. An art historian told Ayers the painting may be the work of Italian Renaissance artist Raphael, who had a distinct way of painting the Madonna. But that was just the beginning. Through extensive research, these are only some of the boxes. Ayers learned the painting was brought from Italy to Kentucky by a bishop who started a convent. It eventually was sold to an antiques dealer and ended up in England. Still, it's not been easy convincing the skeptical art world the painting is real. We have scholars that believe it's a Raphael. We have the pigments that matches a Raphael, and now we have the AI. Two years ago, the friends hired an artificial intelligence firm that analyzed brush strokes. It confirmed the faces of Mary and baby Jesus were painted by Raphael. Workers in his studio most likely completed the rest. We know that the painting was, uh, the main figure were painted by Raphael, but it was finished by other hands. Sadly, Ayers died from Alzheimer's last year. But his friends say this has been a labor of love and hope Chicagoans will one day get the chance to appreciate this rare painting. Karen Jordan, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.